they use the semi PP hole, but also use the standard inlet ports and then link it all up through the water jackets of the plates and the housings. So you've got basically three different avenues of the air coming into the motor. Okay, and did you fabricate this manifold yep, here? So I bought like a standard manifold and then added the semi PP pipes, I suppose you call them. Yep. Um, and then, yeah, I end up doing majority of the porting myself. How far back do the, the headers go back? And you Pretty, fabricated that as well. About halfway, so it comes to, yeah, about halfway, and then it joins into one and then runs through two, three inch uh, stainless mufflers. tall port plates so to achieve this style PP you have to run them they sort of used to do it in the 90s with the improved production because they weren't allowed to have a PP but this was sort of a way of hiding it without anyone knowing how often do you drive the car uh, not very often obviously it's I'm only gonna have it this way which is low and loud so I just try to take it to some events and try to limit myself because I need a license for work how much does this thing weigh 860 kilos as you see it full interior as you see it. And the power, what sort of numbers does it make? So it makes 250 horsepower, uh, revs to just over 10 grand. Um, so in comparison to a 4 GE, it's 10 times better. It's a smaller package, it sits lower in the engine bay, giving you a better centre of gravity. More power, more revs, and it's amped Have you taken it down the quarter at all? Yeah, it's run a mid-12 with a lot of wheel spin. So uh, 119 mile an hour it's done so far. <laughs> How long has it taken to get the car to this level? Uh, I've owned the car for well, the best part of seven years, but uh, I, I did have a couple of 4AGs in them, blew them up, um, so I was like, oh, I've had enough of this, so did this engine swap uh, in just over three months, actually. So I drove in 4AG with a bottom end off and drove out with 13B, and so I did it all myself. What's the best way to get hold of you, Ben? Uh, probably through Instagram, and that's uh, drift underscore zilla. Um, if you want to check anything that's to do with this car, it'll be there. I've got a full Radio FD in the build and also drive for the Hot Wheels stunt team. Thanks for watching my radar on this part.